Hi guys, what's up? Welcome to Some Destiny 2. Um, I've never played this game before, so no, the um title is not clickbait. I have no idea what I'm getting into, but um, this game went free to play, and I've heard some good things, so it should be fun. I hope. I think I'm gonna go with the um hunter class, or maybe warlock. Uh, decisions, decisions. Hmm. This is actually a pretty hard choice. I'm gonna go with the hunter. Um. So yeah, we're just gonna make our character real quick and get into the gameplay. I don't know how many videos I'm gonna make for this just because you know everyone and their mom seen Destiny's campaign so I doubt anyone's like super interested but I thought I'd just like try it out and share my thoughts with you guys also I haven't posted um, a video in a while so you know I don't like any of these human faces really, except that one, but he, I don't know, it's not working for me, I guess, uh, I mean, hmm. man, I'm not gonna lie, I'm just not feeling it, I didn't mean to back out that far, uh, I think I'm gonna go with a, an awoken female, Already starting off with a decent default face already, but let me see. That one looks nice. Dark lips, definitely. Um, here. Ooh, I like this. I think I already made my pick by just checking through all the rest to see what they have on offer, but yeah, I like this one. Definitely gonna try to make her look as goth as I possibly can. <laughs> nice. Okay, that looks cool. She looks scary as hell. I like it. Um, makeup. Uh, let's see. What do I want? That looks pretty decent. Yeah guys, I think that this is it. Um yeah I'm gonna go with that. I think that's everything, right? Ooh, yeah. Let's get started. Character customization is pretty decent for like these, you know, kind of games. These games as a service games. 
I find that when it comes to customization, well, the division's the only other thing I can compare it to. And I guess the Ghost Recon beta? But yeah, customization's usually a bit lacking. I don't know. Like, I felt like... Guardian? Eyes up, Guardian. Let me shut up for this cutscene. Work! You're alive! You don't know how long I've been looking for you. I'm a ghost. Actually, now I'm your ghost. And you? Well, you've been dead a long time. So you're going to see a lot of things you won't understand. This is fallen territory. We aren't safe here. I have to get you to the city. Hold still. Don't worry, I'm still with you. We need to move, fast. All right, so it is the intro from Destiny 1, I think. It's interesting. So, Bungie has obviously made some changes since leaving Activision, which is kind of the best thing they could have possibly done. Um, these major publishers are assholes, dude. Just greedy assholes. Anyway, I'm not getting into that, but... Great. What it's was they saying? Now, yeah, customization in these kind of games are, are lacking. Our only way forward is through that wall. Uh, I feel like I compare everything to Dragon Age Inquisition now, and I feel like that had like one of the best customization systems to to the out there. To do that, we'll need a ship. But first, I need to find you a weapon. Let's keep moving. Careful. They're all around us. Dude, that is creepy as hell. <laughs> like, that actually kind of jumped me. I'm not gonna lie. It's a risk, but I'll get us more light. Dude, do you see Our this? Military system. Check. Frayed wires and rust. Check. I want out of here now. Expect trouble. What the hell? Definitely not uh, run away. There's a rifle. Grab it. Where? Oh. I brought you back for a reason, Guardian. You're a hunter. That means you're not afraid to take risks. So keep moving and be ready for a fight. So I wonder if I pick any other class if you would have said something different, like you're a warlock. You're I don't know, smart or something. <laughs> like that my aim sucks by the way just letting you guys know in advance not very good um when it comes to aiming with two sticks i don't know cloud's the only shooter i've been stay focused decent at the tracker blinks there's trouble Hong Kong soul, so there's that pretty good at apex well it depends on the day and I haven't played in a while. I'm definitely gonna be checking out the Omni um, season and posting a video. I'm gonna try to get that new character unlocked. So I can get some gameplay with him also. It's gonna take a while, but. Alien pirates picking at humanity's remains. Speaking of pirates, Ooh, loot chest. there's a loot cache. Let's take what's inside. Nice. I have no idea what kind of gun that is, but you know. Oh, it's a shotgun. Get wrecked. Shoot this. Damn, it reloads so slow. Oh, like it took really long. Got it. Oh damn, this guy has a shield. Oh, that's not fun. Shit. He was 
just like hiding back there like no nope. I don't want any part of this nice okay so I have the golden gun I remember this but I'm pretty sure there's also like other power-ups that you get that you can like, choose which one I don't completely remember I, I've seen some stuff for this game but not too much I've no, I've only like now started getting into like, I don't know, games as games a service. Why do I always mess up when I say that? Online games, stuff. Like before when it came to multiplayer games, it was always just like, I don't know, something like COD or just simple, a Keep simple PvP shooter. I'll locate a ship we can use to fly home. As opposed to a game like this where there's, you know, a bunch of loot and leveling and all that stuff. Fallen raiding party. We're in more trouble than I thought. And I'm not gonna lie, most of these games are pretty shitty, pretty um just exploitative. They came looking for what the fight. hell is this thing? Just like trying to I don't think that's what it's supposed to be doing, but I kinda wanna kill that thing now. Yeah, most most um uh, games in the service games are cash grab. That's, that's all they are. Like, let's try to make as much money off I'm these people as possible. Ships. And uh, a lot of them are pretty soulless, but I don't know. It's Bungie, man. And from what I heard, Destiny is pretty good. Has a interest, has some like interest in lore and stuff behind it. So I was down to try it out, Focus especially now that it's free. I don't really have an excuse to not to. And so far. It's fun. <laughs> I really should shut up and like try to focus. But yeah, so far I'm really enjoying the um, shooting. The shooting feels so solid, dude. Um, Bungie's always done a really good job with shooters. Um, after all, they made the original call. Um, not COD. What am I saying? Halo. Great. Yes, the uh, first three Halo games were made by then and they're arguably the best one I would say Reach was pretty good but it was also really different and Halo 5 doesn't exist as far as I'm concerned 4 was okay but like Halo 5 was kind of a disappointment and I know a lot of people hate the art direction change that I didn't have a problem with I can like the new art itself for like spider armor and stuff like that the thing that I had a problem with was um, just storytelling in general then killing off Cortana and then bringing her back to the bad day and stuff like that. There, there was a way to do that properly within the context of the lore, but you know, it wasn't done well. So. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, give me a sec. All right, so I'm not supposed to be here, so let me just. Run. It's time to move that was fun. Um, so I guess I'm gonna have to come back and kill that giant robot thing eventually. When we get to the city, or maybe that was like a daily, not a daily, a, a late the event. People, the promise of a brighter future, and the traveler. Wait till you see it. So yeah, they keep talking about this thing called the Traveler, and I wonder what the hell that is. Here we go. Let's take that ship.
take a right, look at your new ship. It's been here a while. Hasn't made a jump in centuries. We're lucky the fallen haven't completely picked a clean. Will it fly? Don't know how we feel how I feel about our voice. I don't think we could have picked another one though, so nah. It's not gonna lay. It does not look like a person could fit inside like that comfortably. Okay. Kinda looks more I'm like a drone than like a mad shit. Now, about that transmission. Oh no, I do not want to fight that thing. Let's go. Let's leave. Bringing you in. Thank you. Yeah, but it does not look like a person can fit in there. It looks like a drone more than like a ship that would have to We can come back to them when you're ready. Anyway, let's get you it, it's a fantasy game. I don't know why I'm nitpicking stuff like this. I never knew you in life. Your first life, anyway. You died on a battlefield long before my time. Something special brought us together. They called it the Traveler. And when it arrived, it changed your world forever. It was a golden age. And for centuries, humanity thrived until it didn't. An ancient enemy pursued the Traveler across the universe. Humanity faced extinction. But the Traveler made a choice. Its sacrifice destroyed its ancient enemy and brought life to the ghosts. I am a ghost. More importantly, I'm your ghost. And you are one of the Traveler's Chosen. You are a Guardian. Okay. This is your I'm pretty destiny. Hyped. Not gonna lie. That, that was a cool little opening. Um, so yeah. I'm gonna call it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me come back. I guess we'll continue on. If you guys want to see more dice, which you can let me know by leaving a like or a comment. And yeah, I will see you guys later. The last survivors of humanity's collapse call the city home. This is why I brought you back. To defend them. And to reclaim our lost worlds. We're here. The Traveler. The last city. Welcome home.